Well, hello. Harvey Dent, Gotham's next mayor, and eager to know you. Vicki Vale, not interested, and reporter for the Gotham Gazette. This is a private fundraiser, Miss Vale. No reporters allowed. Well, you don't mind if I stay and ask a few questions, do you, Mr. Wayne? Well, you can ask me whatever you want at the press conference tomorrow. Tonight is strictly off the record. We can talk, but nothing gets written down. I'm okay with that. I was just hoping to see what makes Bruce Wayne tick. This is quite the social event, Mr. Wayne. Oh, come on now. So formal. Call me Bruce. Well, <laughs> Bruce, you've been going around pleasing everyone tonight. But how are you doing? You should enjoy your own party before all the champagne runs out. Just between us, politics bore the hell out of me. Too many words, not enough action. Didn't think you were the type to get his hands dirty. Oh, you'd be surprised. Mr. Wayne, you've... you've got something on your collar. Um, is that blood? Yeah, it looks like... Oh, this? No, that's nothing. It just, uh, cut myself shaving. Well, what, your butler didn't help you this time? Hey, kidding, kidding. Do excuse me, Master Bruce, but uh, another guest has arrived. I'm sure they'll find the bar. You may want to greet this one personally, sir. Carmine Falcone? Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Falcone's never been convicted of anything, except being a businessman who loves this city. Excuse us, Miss Vale. <laughs> and what kind of business do you think he's in? The one that controls enough votes to get me into City Hall. This is the necessary evil of politics, Bruce. It's in the service of a better Gotham, for all of us. Look, at least hear him out before you kick him out. Falcone requested to speak with you directly. Maybe he can change your mind. Jesus, Harvey, inviting a known criminal to your fundraiser doesn't exactly look good for your squeaky clean image. Let me worry about that. A word of warning, Bruce? Play nice. Yeah, well, that's just like Harvey, huh? Wants to make sure the rules are followed. But in my experience, there's the law, and there's doing what's right. You understand? And I'd rather see Harvey actually help this city instead of just saying he will. The man talks too much, chaps my face with words. Well, I would say you can uphold the law and still do what's right. To a point. No one gets remembered for staying in the middle. I ain't here to chinwag about politics, Mr. Wayne. Gives me indigestion. I got enough of that as is. So, let's talk relationship. Chalk this for me. Be a pal. I can get Harvey the mayor's seat. Or I can pull it out from under him. Whatever happened to being a gracious host? Okay, imagine, this is me. And these are all my friends in Gotham. The businesses, restaurants, clubs, docks, unions, politicians. I make them all move. And I want to keep everything moving if Harvey gets elected. That's why I came here tonight to your lovely home, hoping to make a new friend. One who can help Mr. Dent see the light, if need be. Between your businesses and mine, I bet we employ half the city. Yeah, that's not happening. Hey, this isn't a deal with the devil. You listen to me, kid. I know somewhere inside that tuxedo you understand this situation. Money gets money. The risks, the alliances, the hidden costs. Your father knew which hands to shake. And which to break. I think I'll have someone see you out. 
Okay. Okay. So that's how it's gonna be. People don't say no to me.